Hey, 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 what's going on, everybody? Welcome to my channel, T Girl Magic Tarot. Here to do a reading for my J -J Gemini, my Gemini's. What is going on, Gemini? Welcome, welcome, cross watchers, new family, new subscribers, old subscribers. Everybody is welcome and loved. Sending you in a bunch, and a bunch, a bunch of love, light, and healing vibes, Gemini. Yes, okay. I hope everyone is doing well. Um, I'll tell you the story when we do the song. Okay, so it's a general message. It's not going to resonate with everybody. So take the messages that resonate and leave the rest. Okay. Choir, come to the front. <clears throat> One, two, three, oh, T girl, T girl, magic and collective. T girl, T girl, T girl, magic and collective. T girl, T girl, magic and collective. Come check us out and see what we're about. Oh, we are Gemini, 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 Gemini. We sing Gemini, 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 Gemini. Gemini, we are Gemini, 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 oh Gemini, 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 oh Gemini, Gemini, Gemini. Yay! Hallelujah! You know what? I giggle every time because you guys may put a smile on my face when I sing. The, it puts me in a fucking good ass mood, better than I was before. That's why we do this, y'all. Okay, we got the babies pop locking. We got the mamas and the daddies pop locking. Child, we got choir and percussions and shit. I know y'all be in the background with your drums and your fuck y'all. I know y'all got the beat and your instruments and shit. Singing and I love it, Gemini. Okay, but um, the story that I wanted to share with you is okay. So y'all know I started this little juicing and shit, or been doing this juicing for a little bit. And I don't like avocado, okay? I hate I, I hate avocado. That's a strong word, but I really, 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 well, not as much as I used to, but I don't like avocado at all. Ever since a child, my, my, ever since my palate could touch the avocado, it doesn't matter what it is, guacamole, it just don't matter. I don't like avocado. I know what I know what I know. So I'm saying all of this to say, Jim and I. Oh, let me, let me back up a little bit more. I know I'm all over the place, y'all. I got ADHD, I think. Look, I think it wasn't diagnosed, but I think I have OCD, ADHD, whatever. Oh, confirmation. But anyway, um, my daughter was like, well, you know, because I wanted to get a little more together firm, you know, avocado, the goddess fruit. So I said, let me, she said, well, you know, you want to try it in a smoothie with you know the greenery and i said okay we'll, we'll try that she's like because it'll make it all creamy and smooth and blah 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 let me tell you it did it made it so amazing i was like oh my god i wish i would have known this about um avocado a long time ago i would have been consuming it more now i've been noticing that i've been on it for quite some time is every time i consume the smooth the green smoothie my ass get ibs like i start fucking what is it pooting and farting and popping and shit Stomach started hurting, dry heat, headache, fallout. I said, what the hell is going on? And I felt poisoned, and I knew it was like some type of allergy. And I said, the spirit kept saying, it's a food allergy, it's a food allergy, it's a food allergy. And I was like, what? So anyway, I Googled it, and spirit was right. It is a food allergy. I'm allergic to fucking avocado, so I said all this to say that. When you know you don't like something, Gemini... And it doesn't matter what form, fashion, do not fucking conform. My body already knew that I didn't like avocado. Okay? It didn't have to tell me. It, it, had, to, it had to get sick and fucking have a reaction because it knew that avocado wasn't for me. When you know something isn't for you, it's nothing wrong with trying different things. That's what I'm saying. But if you know something is, t is not good for you or you don't like something and then you try to conform anyway, it is going to fuck you up because you didn't conform to something that wasn't for you. Okay, these relationships and stuff. Don't conform to these relationships to try to make somebody else happy. Don't do that. Y'all have relationships. Don't try to conform to someone else. You just go within. You already know what the fuck you like, High Priestess. You know. Okay, don't let nobody tell you different. Okay, make up your mind. Don't let you switch up. And, oh, you don't want to feel left out in the cold or you don't want to be look, the only one feeling different. You're going to hit the fucking ground like I did. You know what I mean? <laughs> I was all on the bed, child. I had to take a nap and everything. I was like, Lord have mercy. But anyway, I'm fine now. 
I had to let it, you know, run its course, and then I had to do some meditation and let it get itself out of my system. So, yeah, no more avocado for me, okay? Confirmation. Thank you, Spirit. But anyway, Holy Spirit, so what's going on in Gemini's energy? I'm, what's going on in Gemini's? Oh, so some of y'all, yeah. That was the whole, that was the, that was the goal. Don't let, don't conform. If you know it's not for you, leave that shit alone. Spirit, what's going on in Gemini's energy? What's happening? What's happening in Gemini's energy? Jim, oh my God, Jim and I did I flip these cards again? Hold on, y'all. Oh my God, somebody, okay. I'm going to shuffle those things. I already pick up some deception. What's going on in Gemini's energy spirit? Something in the courthouse, I don't know, somebody's about to lie. A main female is about to lie, child, in the courthouse. Yes! A main female, Gemini, in your energy, if you guys are facing a legal situation, a divorce, or whatever the case may be, you have a lying-ass female. Or it could be you lying to the court system, to the justice, justice system, lying to the justice system, possibly about money and work and occupation. So this is a battle of financial ish, financial resources, okay? Somebody who you used to hold in high honor and is now in despair because... Uh, they're thinking about jail time or getting caught up or something. I don't know, Gemini. Anyways, there's a female that's a liar in your energy. My my men's is watch out if you're going through a divorce. Somebody's literally getting ready to lie about their finances. Okay, I'm picking up finances. I don't know if they're trying to hide money to say they didn't make as much as they made or whatever the case may be. Okay, but anyway, what else, spirit? Oh. Somebody from the past. Yeah, somebody from the past. If somebody's trying to cover up the past or lie about a past or lie about a main female in a court session. So if this is for my ladies and you divorcing your husband, him trying to lie about another female from his past that he has been dating. Yes, and this is the truth. Okay, he's trying to lie. He's trying to... But it's going to be revealed, though. Oh, yeah. Oh, it's all for the money, child. So I don't know if you're trying to clean them out, clean them up, or whatever. Get your just due for this motherfucker cheating on you. Yeah, him, him nervous. Look, him, child. I don't know if it's him getting the information or you getting the information that's going to make you clutch your pearls about these lies. So it could be, now take the roles as they fit. Now it could be a female that's a liar and a mature male that's a liar. Okay, so and and then this woman, if you're my man, you're a woman, you're you're whoever you divorcing. This wealthy man has private eye on. Ooh, yeah, okay. Somebody's about to get backstabbed and fucked up in court, child. Oh my God, the other lover has been exposed. Oh my God, there's a hell of a lot going on in this Gemini circle. So for my women. Your man is hired a private investigator to catch you cheating on them for court, okay? Now, for my other ones, oh my God. And then flip it if you're a, a, a man or a woman, okay? Um, she's hired a private investigator for this rich man, okay? Because she's, she's feeling like somebody from his past. Oh my God, they got love. Oh shit, it's about to come out out in court oh pi and whatever the pi found out child hold on hold on hold on look 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 and whatever the pi found out child it could get him in prison or they're all in their head okay so i'm just keeping i see it right now this wealthy man is cheating on this main female with another man and then flip it if it's a woman this wealthy man hired uh, private eye and they found out that oh but honey this is telling me that this main female right here she done caught her wealthy man because they are wealthy together in this beautiful family room that's empty child she about to get a message of concern from this motherfucking investigator that's gonna put somebody on their knees honey and they are gonna find out that they're not cheating because the main female thought that the wealthy man was cheating on her uh, with a man. I mean, with the fe with the female. But honey, come to find out, him is cheating on him with a queen, a king of cups, Lord, and possibly another king of pentacles. Child, oh my God, my stomach hurt. And then Gemini, you don't cut him out, or you cutting him out because they have holistic ways with this king of wands energy. Child, you don't cut him. Oh Lord, wait. Oh, child, look. 
They might be, they coming out. That's how they coming out the closet. I don't know if y'all seen Bill Duke's cover. This sounds like a Bill Duke's cover shit. This is back in, the, I think, the movie that came out in the, um... Bill Duke is the producer and cover is the movie Vivica Fox, I remember very clearly. And then that lady from The Diary of a Mad Black Woman, she played in it. And then Shamar Amor or what is in it. And then that guy Leon was a Cynthia from The Real Housewives of Atlanta. Her husband Leon, he played Leon. But you know, he might, he might be a Leon. But anyway, he played the gay man in there too, child. The Transformation Butterflies, child. Oh my God, this is too much. The wealthy man was prostituting with other men's and paying the other men's. Is this rape? I don't know. Mm, 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 mm. Look, 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 look. Other lovers, great fortune, hands exchanging and shit. Oh God, Gemini. What the hell is going on? Okay, hold on. Let me take some in. And then I'm also picking up. Mm, mm, mm. The third party situation may want to approach you. You like approach me? Yes, approach you, Gemini. High vibe, cross watcher, whoever you are. This other lover of this wealthy man, this King of Cups energy child, he's trying to message you. Him is messaging you, and you look at you, Gemini. You guard it energetically and physically. You like, I don't want to hear shit. That anyone has to say, yeah, it's somebody from their past. So this older gentleman that this wealthy man or this wealthy man could be the same one as this older gentleman. Regardless of what is what, somebody got some, uh, somebody got splain, some splaining to do, Lucy. You got some splaining to do, okay? This man gonna come to you all crushed and sad and shit, trying to give you discovery. What the fuck trying to put you all in your head? So for y'all, some of y'all, the karmic is, oh shit, okay. For some of y'all, the karmic is a female, and then the karmic is a female and a male lover at the same time, and then some of them is just a male lover, okay? But however the karmic wants to come towards you, to, and whatever they're going to tell you, and whatever they're going to say to you, they might show you proof, some type of pictures, or whatever. You might go into a depression. You might, like, you're going to regret that you ever known this person, ever. I don't know what the fuck. This is going to happen in the distant horizon, and whatever is done and said... It is going to cause a fucking transformation, an ending, a completion, a whatever, a death, all of that shit. Lord, and somebody going to feel backstabbed and betrayed, honey. Oh, yes. And there definitely will be no reconciliation because this motherfucker was given to other cups. You see the four of cups? You was the, the, what God was giving you. And then these are these other three cups. The other, the, these are the other cups. The king of cups, king of pentacles, and that main female. So... The, your person or whoever is a little hoe with this king of wands energy that shot, chop, chopped, got chopped up. I don't That showed up. Oof, Jesus Christ. Mm, mm, mm. Child, there, it, the plot thickens. There's definitely two male kings. One is hot to trot and willing to sleep with anybody, having all kind of third parties doing whatever they want to do, whenever they want to do. And look how he's looking at them cups in that third party. Okay, this wealthy man with this mature man, this mature man's over here. Like, yeah, Gina. And they, ugh. Sure, all for money. So somebody went down, so this wealthy man paying this king of cups. Yeah, he popping it in the booty hole, fun honey, for some unexpected income. Yes, and this motherfucking wealthy man pays well. Because this King of Cups loving is bomb.com. You see how they all engulfed in each other and shit? He like, well, shit. I might want to go down there. I mean, they just want to go down that path. Oh, oh. And you're this, this, this. So somebody got some proof. Either the detective got the proof. Somebody got some proof, okay? And the detective got the proof from someone that hired this detective. Um, and someone's going through, a, whoever's going through a legal situation that's ending things right now. This is a messy-ass fucking situation. Oof. Queen of Pentacles, yes. And she's all in her head. So, Gemini, you could be all in your head. This Queen of Pentacles, this main female who hired this detective could be all in their head. But somebody is about to be facing jail time. And, yes, yeah, somebody's coming back to deliver some news to you, honey. And whatever news is going to leave you stuck. Whatever the news is, is going to leave you stuck. And if there's a completed of a cycle, and this is going to probably be able to, for some of you, from if not all of y'all, whoever is this energy is, to walk away and release this person for good. Oh, shit. Mm. Mm. 
Mm. And I'm just going to keep it real for some of y'all. I mean, you might lose the court case when this information comes out. So, so if this is not them going through, no, you go, oh my God, how do I say this? Because some of you are going through this and then it's on your other side. So, but the other side, they're going to lose because whoever this investigator is, this main male or whoever main female is going to present this shit in court. Okay, they're going to be so humiliated, so embarrassed with this Five of Cups energy that they were exposed. So now this main male, I mean this wealthy male might end because he's been giving his cups away to other lovers. His finances are going to get juggled, okay? And he's going to end up in poverty because he was fucking around in the community. Yeah, this caused the tower for this main male, which is the main male is this wealthy male, okay? In this marriage. Mm-hmm. I can't make that up. That's what, hey, that's what it is. The change. So now this wealthy man, so the, honey, this could be for, this is for my ladies that they're, 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 I don't want to say twin flame, karmic, whoever, okay? Ooh, I don't think your, 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 your soulmate or is this, this is karmic energy right here. So your karmic, who's possibly a wealthy man or a main female, they want to come back to you. And they're going to be in poverty, okay? They're going to be all imprisoned and trapped in their head because of the information that was exposed about them. And now they're going to want to come towards you and heal things with you, Gemini, okay? And balance out the situation. Lord have mercy, that was a lot. I'm going to get the fuck out of this energy. Also because you're at sudden wealth, because you are, look where you, look how you're living and look where you're living. And when they reach out to you, you're going to be clutching your pearls like, bitch, where? Who? Okay? Mm-hmm. Yep, they're reaching out. That's why this wealthy man, well, he used to be wealthy, so he, I mean, that's just the way he got accustomed to living. And um, they're looking at you like this. And sudden wealth, oh, sorry, the privileged lady. The privileged lady, it was sideways. So, child, they might have came at you sideways, or you're going to be looking at their ass sideways when they come to you, but they're looking at you for this. Ten of cups and a fucking payout, handout, whatever you want to call it. But this motherfucker, rich man, was detached from you. They were cold to you. They kind of left you out in the cold and they had a whole bunch of fucking secrets. This person was greedy and stingy. They didn't want to share with you. They didn't think he was good enough. But then now, lo and behold, now they need your ass. So yeah, Gemini, that's going on in your energy. Ooh, that's a lot. I'm going to end it motherfucking right there. Okay, I am open for readings. If y'all want a reading, y'all go ahead and book one. Email me and then wait for me to email you back. And yeah, we can take it from there. So Gemini, I love you guys. Thumbs up for the video, and I'll see y'all later. Love ya. Bye.